Hey guys, I have another tutorial, a bow tie tutorial. So these are the supplies that you're going to need and let's get started. So first I'm going to lay out my fabric that I chose. This is a chevron print, uh, but I'm going to do it kind of in a sideway angle. It is on a fold. So here I'm showing you there, there are two sides to it. And I'm gonna make sure the, those are laid out and they are nice and even. So when I start to cut, next I'm gonna determine the width of the bow tie. And we're gonna be folding this bow tie inwards on both end, top and bottom. So I wanna make sure it's thick enough to my desire. So once you've figured out how thick you want your bow tie to be, you're just gonna cut straight on across. Okay, now that I have the piece that I'm gonna work with, and now I'm going to decide the length that I would like the bow tie to be. And as you can see, I'm showing you how we're going to fold the bottom and the top up. And I'm just trying to decipher the, how um, thick I want it to be. And this looks just about right. So we'll go and cut straight up. And I'm showing you here, both sides are flat. There are no folds. Just make sure everything is nice and lined up, guys. So I'm gonna measure it out how it's going to be. And that's a perfect size. You're gonna to wanna to glue that down to secure it and make sure that everything is glued and secured from the top and the bottom, okay? Okay, so here I'm showing you that the chevrons are going sideways. It's not going like a traditional chevron. This is for boys. So I thought I'd do it a little different. Um, I did press this out afterwards so I can get a nice and structured piece of material. Um, so just make sure that when you're securing it, that you're securing it all the way down so everything would fold and sit properly, okay? So now it's nice and pressed. And I'm just going to fold it and try to get an equal middle point so that we can glue that down there. So you just want to make sure that this is secure on all layers. So we will not have any problems of this coming off. Okay, so now this is what we have. And I'm gonna show you how to form it into the bow tie. Uh, first, we're going to just cut off a little piece for to cover up the middle. And I will show you how I do this. Um, I'm just gonna do probably like one and a half inch to cover it. Um, here I'm just trying to figure out what to do and I decide to do one and a half of an inch and I'm just gonna cut down some ways down, no particular length, uh, just enough so that I feel I need to cover it up. So here's what I have. And this is the part that's gonna go over there. So here we have our bow tie and we're going to pinch the bottom and the top together with your fingers in the middle. And then you're going to lift the bottom up and the top down and pinch it in the middle. And that is going to form your bow tie. It's perfect. Here we go again, pinching the middle, pulling the back bottom up, top down and secure those edges and see that part is just going to cover over there like that. So now we're just going to put a little bit of glue so we can secure those pinched edges. And you're just going to want to hold those very, very tightly into place. Okay. And 
I did not put enough glue on here. So I'm gonna go back through and I'm gonna glue it up some more and get it a little bit more secure so that it wouldn't depend on that wrap so much when I put that on there. So we're gonna get this nice and secure more than it is currently. So now that piece that I had, what I did was I turned one side in and glued it and that's going to be my middle piece. It's going to hold this whole thing together. So here I'm deciphering where I want this. Always figure out what part is going to be the front and what part is going to be the back. And you're gonna to wanna to glue in the back. So here I'm figuring out that's gonna be the front of my bow tie. So I'm going to secure the end of that flap in the back. Here you see me have it lined up. I'm gonna secure the glue there. And I'm just gonna push that down. Make sure you use as much glue as necessary. Um, as long as you don't make it look like uh, noticeable, you could do that. You're also gonna wanna make sure the area where you pinched and gathered, you wanna make sure you're covering that up precisely because you don't want anyone to be able to see that. That is where your middle flap is going to go over, that part where you pinched. So be very careful making sure that we are placing that correctly covering and securing that area. And just hold that firmly and cut off your excess. Okay. And this is your bow tie. Very easy, very simple. And look how cute that is. Now, I made these for the little boys' choir at my church. So this was really, really nice with all black. Okay, so the next part to this tutorial is the elastic band that's going to go around their neck. Um, and what I'm doing is I am gluing, I'm going to glue one end of the elastic band and I'm going to push that inside one of the folds in the back, okay? And that is going to secure the elastic band to the bow tie. Now you wanna be generous with the glue. I wasn't so much generous here, and one of the bow tie's uh, elastic bands came loose, but you, know, you could always reseal it with the glue. So be very generous with the glue. So you just want to determine a generic amount or length of uh, elastic band. You don't want it to be too tight. Remember, it is going to go around the neck. Okay, so you want to go ahead and secure your other end there with some glue. And then stick that right on in on the other side. Okay, and here is your finished bow tie. Very easy, very simple. 